it blurry? We have just arrived in Niagara Falls, Canada and had to pay $25 for parking. Not happy about it. And we thought, oh, we can use our data in Canada. Well, no, so how are we gonna get to the hotel? And we can't use our phones, so, yep. Off to a great start. World travelers, how all right. How much did you pay for parking, Grace? Zero. I paid $25. My money is your money. Hi guys. <laughs> Joe didn't want to be in the first video, which I don't know if this will be my first video. Okay, so today we went to Niagara Falls. First we went to Niagara Falls. We got there at like 11. And um, it was my first time being on the Canadian side in a really long time. I don't know about Joe back there. Um, but we couldn't really go to the Canadian side because my mom didn't have her birth certificate anymore. So we went to the Canadian side for my first time in a while and we looked at the falls for a little bit and then we um, purchased tickets to go on the white water tour and we also purchased tickets to be able to ride the bus there so we got there pretty early um, and it was fun. It was only a quarter of a mile but we got to see the rapids. It was really blue water. And then we went back to the falls. We, w we walked all the way around the falls, which was a pretty long walk. And then we headed out. So we thought we were going to have Wi-Fi because we were like, oh, it's just Canada. And we didn't have any data. We didn't want to pay money to use our data. So we went to the Welcome Center and there was Wi-Fi. So we mapped um, from Niagara Falls to our Airbnb in Toronto. And we just took screenshots of the directions and we're like oh god hopefully we can get there and we did get there there was a lot of traffic it took i almost killed us it took like two hours and 45 minutes it should have only taken less than two hours and it was very trafficy. but we finally got here we got to the airbnb it's actually really big it's a studio apartment there's a fish tank with fishies and a frog which is cool um, it's our first time using Airbnb. It was pretty cheap. We got to use a $40 off coupon. Um, so once we dropped off our stuff, we went and found a place to eat, which was pretty hard. But we found an Italian restaurant because I really wanted some pasta. And so we walked down there. It was about a 15 minute walk and we were hangry, very hungry. Kensington Market and we walked it took us 45 minutes to walk to Kensington Market better than a $10 Uber Yes, the Uber was like actually like $13 Which is more expensive than public transport and we didn't feel like Figuring out how to do public transport so we walked and we went to Kensington Market lots of little sh um, Places to eat so we got, went and got a cookies and cream waffle, which is really good And now we're heading to the CN Tower He is walking along the wall. <laughs> so cool. Joe's very afraid. He was clinging to the wall, so I think he's out in the center part where you can't really see. Yep. He's right here. He's very scared. We saw a helicopter right here. The helicopter is as high as we are. Right there. 
so cool. So the sky, the sky pod is above where we were before. Get out of my frame. Oh. Uh, 